What's good, teachers? Today, I'm gonna show you how to keep an eye on your little friends at all times. Are you ready? <laughs> Let's go. All right, so I just made that video about how to share a portion of your screen, and I explained what a better experience it is for your kids, and I kept getting these little DMs about how to share your screen, but also be able to keep an eye on your kids at the same time. I just didn't realize how many of you were struggling with that, so, Today, I'm gonna to show you how to share your screen and view all of your kids at the same time. So granted, my setup is not the norm. I got a lot going on behind me and it gives me a lot of screen real estate and allows me to, to do things that maybe are not possible for some of you guys. So today, I'm gonna to show you how to share your screen and I'll only be using my laptop screen to do it. And it's super simple in Zoom. Unfortunately, a lot of the things that I talk about are just not available in Google Meet. You know I'm a Googler, I love Google, but right now Zoom is just a way better platform and experience again for your kids and I apologize Google Meeters. But unfortunately, in Google Meet you have to jump through a bunch of hoops in order to achieve the same experience on that platform. So let me quit talking and let me show you how to do it. What's up, everybody? Andy, you got a new view here. We're looking from the side this time. Gavin! I didn't hear a word you said. Um, my robot boy again. Yes, robot boy again. Caitlin, how are you today? I'm good. I'm so happy you're here today. Jenny, it's good to see you. Catherine, I missed you this morning. Annika, why do you look so happy today? Now you look happy. Layla! I always love seeing my friend Layla. Nikhil, how are you? Tomorrow's the last day of trimester, guys. So you gotta make sure that you have turned in everything. Okay, so, so right here I'm sharing a to... portion of my screen and the participants pop up in a little film strip window on the side. On the top of that film strip, there's four icons that allow you to customize the view of your participants. If you click on the grid, you can resize the grid by grabbing one of the corners and dragging it and it will allow you to view all of your students at the same time. Look for anything that you have zeros on. So that's it you guys. You just have to click on that little icon and stretch out the screen a little bit and then you can view your students while at the same time sharing your screen. I hope this answers a lot of your questions and you're able to help all of your students just a little bit more. Secretly, not so secretly, I love helping you guys because I know ultimately it's gonna help a lot of kids. And that's what we do as teachers, right? We want to help as many kids as possible. That's why I don't hold back, you guys. I share everything that I know so that you can help as many kids as possible. My name is Darren Nakakihara, and that is your tech tip of the day. Have a wonderful day, guys. I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.